Travel Days here. My name is Adil. I'm originally from Morocco, living here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. Welcome back to Travel Days. Um, today I am in uh, KL Central. As you can see, I took the train to this huge uh, bus station. It has everything. As you can see, it looks like an airport, but it's basically a bus station with a lot of restaurants, coffee shops. There is a mall attached to it. Today, I want to get a ticket to go to, to, to Thailand, possibly tomorrow, if I can, by train to Hatiai, which I have done before, of course. So that's why I came here. Uh, you can also have, uh, you can also buy a plane ticket, an Air Asia ticket here, because they have an office up there. Uh, I think one level down. Uh, where you can buy tickets because last time I went to Medan, Indonesia, I bought it from here. Okay, so so you can uh, you can buy uh, you can buy you can either use the train uh, inside Malaysia. You can, you can take a train from Kuala Lumpur to another city in Malaysia from here, or you can take a train from here all the way to Thailand. You know. Or you can uh, get a ticket, plane ticket. Well, it, it, it has so many, many options here. So let's go. I'm gonna go to the ticket counter. If I, re I think I remember where it is. You think uh, it's at the first floor there, and see if I can get a train ticket to Hatiai from Kuala Lumpur for tomorrow. All right. So as you can see, uh, this station is always, always busy. You see a lot of people traveling, you know, luggage and everything. It looks like an airport, as I said. But actually, these are people. Uh, actually, you can take the train from here to the airport. Also, to LIA, Kuala Lumpur International Airport. So this is like a, a, a very, very uh, essential station to the transportation uh, system here in, in Kuala Lumpur. Okay, so we're gonna go up. Let's see. We're gonna go, I think, up that way. Or, no, we're gonna go up that way, okay? Near, near McDonald's to the right side. I remember I had bought a ticket. I had bought a ticket to uh, Hatiai last time from here, okay? So let's go. All right, so this is where I bought the ticket last time. Uh, VIP ticket to, train ticket to, from Kuala Lumpur to Hatiai, Thailand. Okay, so let's go and see if they still do that. All right, so I talked to the girl there at the reception. She was very, very helpful right there. And the counters are here where you buy the tickets. Right there behind me, that's, that's, those are the counters. So I talked to the receptionist and um, no trains for today for sure, because I saw the sign. No trains for tomorrow morning or afternoon to Thailand, all booked. So I bought it. I'm gonna buy a ticket for tomorrow at night. I'm gonna leave here at 10:50 at night and get at the border town at at 4:30 in the morning. And I only have to wait like two hours for the Thai border to open so I can continue to Hatiai. So that's not bad at all. Uh, basically, I'm gonna spend the six or seven hours on the train from Kuala Lumpur to Padambasar, the same place that I went to last time, if you watch my previous videos in 2000, uh, 2022, two years ago, I went to the same place and I went to the same place twice. I crossed to Thailand from the same point, which is Padambasar. You can see that. And then I went to Padambasar in Thailand and then Hatiai, the next city in Thailand. So this is what I'm gonna do tomorrow uh, night. Uh, so I got a ticket. They will give you a ticket, okay? And then you have to queue. You have to queue and buy the ticket for tomorrow. I haven't bought it yet. I just talked to the information girl there uh, who told me all this kind of information that I gave you. Okay, so uh, let's buy the tickets. I'm buying VIP because I has to be comfortable and it comes with food and just a little blah, blah. I think I, I, if I remember about $45 for seven hours. Very, very good train aircon food everything you know you can watch my previous videos where i went there in 2022 and you can see the kind of food that they gave us i traveled by day back then the two times i went to thailand to hatiai by train from kuala lumpur i traveled by day so uh, so it was like lunch breakfast and lunch and all that so i'm gonna do the same thing tomorrow night you know this so is gonna be dinner and food and probably early breakfast before we arrive to the border town but padambasar Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna buy the ticket from there. Okay, 
I'm, uh, I'm taking number and I'm waiting. All right, so my number is next, 386. My number is 387, 3087, okay? And... Okay, so I bought the ticket for $38. As you can see from Kuala Lumpur, Air Central to Padang Bazaar. As you can see, 181 ringgit, okay? And this is $38, okay? For like seven hours on VIP seat. So you get the food, you get the VIP lounge before we go, before we, we board the train. As I remember, last time it was the same thing. And uh, you have a very, very comfortable seat because it is business class or VIP, VIP class, whatever they call it, you know, it's the best seat, okay? So uh, for $38, it's not that bad, okay? For seven hours on a world-class train, okay? Aircon, food, uh, toilet, everything you want. They even have a cafeteria there if you want to buy something. But you don't have to, in the, in the, if you buy a ticket like this, they give you coffee, tea, drinks, chocolate, food, you know? As I said, you can watch my previous video and you can see the food that they have given us, breakfast, lunch, and tea time, okay? Because back then they traveled during the daytime, okay? So tomorrow it's gonna be probably dinner and breakfast the next morning and some snacks or something like that, okay? So it's, it's really good, good value for, uh, the trains are cheap here, okay? And you can get this train from here, from KL Central, Kuala Lumpur, all the way to the border of Thailand, okay? Okay, so I bought the tickets for tomorrow for $38. US dollars, 181 ringgit, okay, you see the KL Central is so beautiful, okay, and let me show you, you can buy tickets here, Air Asia tickets, you know, like plane tickets using Air Asia Airlines from here, which I did last time when I went to Midan in 2023, my first trip in 2023 to Indonesia, and I have a video about that too, so you see that red opening right there that is air asia okay that's where i bought my ticket from so if you come to kl central and you need an, a plane ticket air asia office is here i'm not sure if there is malaysian airline or other airlines here i have no idea uh i see her here all airlines and stuff you probably have uh you know like ask people here you see that one and the office of for Air Asia is right here, okay? You can see the sign right there, Air Asia, okay? Right there, okay? All right, so so this is the information for you today from Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia, from KL Central. I'm gonna go to Mid Valley uh, to see if I can uh, change some money. Uh, I have a little bit of uh, Thai baht, the currency of Thailand, from last time I went there, from 2022, you know, two years ago. But it's not enough. I have like 200 baht and some Cambodian money from the Cambodian trip. So I need to go and change some money. So tomorrow I will not be in a rush or anything. Tomorrow I'll just wash my clothes and pack and everything. So I don't have to do all this work tomorrow. Especially buying the tickets, you have to buy the ticket early, okay? So uh, I'm gonna find out if there is a train from here to to Mid Valley, to Mid Valley Mall, okay? To change the money because they have the best change rates uh, here in Kuala Lumpur. Every time I want to travel, I, tr I, I change money there, okay? All right, so I asked the policeman up there uh, and he said you can take the train from here, from here, from uh, KL Central to Mid Valley, okay? By train, of course. So he said after McDonald's, I think it's this one, K KTM commuter, okay? Let's see. That one, KTM commuter, there is a McDonald's here. And if you take the escalator up there, to the right-hand side, you can buy the ticket to Thailand. Okay, so remember this. Okay. And as you can see, it looks like an airport. It's nice, a lot of people are traveling through here. You can go to KLIA airport. Kuala Lumpur International Airport from here also by train, okay? Uh, I don't like to use the machines, I need to ask somebody, okay? Alright, so yes, I took the train from uh, KL Central 
to Mill Valley Mall the first time. I've been here in this country for a long time and I've never taken the train to Mill Valley before because I drive all the time, okay? So this is very nice. The train was uh, 160, uh, one ringgit 60 is like uh, less than, it's like 50 cents, a bit less than 50 cents. So it's cheap, okay? And it took like uh, basically a few minutes, like three minutes. So because it's so close to each other. So I'm going into the mall right now. As you see, this is Mid Valley Mall. This is the mall that I told you about in a previous video. You can come here to change money. It's a huge, huge mall, beautiful mall. There's a highway there. And uh, they have like the best uh, money changers rates here, okay? So let's go. All right, welcome to Mid Valley Mall. Oh, nice and aircon. I was sweating. Even the train is aircon though. The trains in Malaysia are very, very nice and aircon, very comfortable. But this mall, wow, so cool. Nice and cool. Oof. All right, so I need some coffee, to be honest with you. I only had some eggs and bread at home. And Mid Valley Mall has a lot of coffee shops, have a lot of places. So I think before I change the money or anything like that, I prefer to have some coffee, sit down and rest, relax for a, for a minute, um, and then continue, okay? I'll show you the money changers and everything when I get there. And uh, Mid Valley Mall is very, very famous. It's huge, it's big, it's, it's been here for a while. Uh, everybody in Malaysia, in, in Kuala Lumpur knows Mid Valley Mall. So if you visit here, you have to come to this mall for sure, you know? food everything you need you know and it's a uh, it's a nice place to hang out usually it's, it's really really busy on the weekends so this mall is like uh, the the icon of, uh, of uh, the malls here in uh, in Malaysia okay all right so I'm gonna have coffee in that coffee shop right behind me with that sign is but I'm gonna buy some pastry from down here uh, they have some really really good I, I've always seen pastries here that I liked and uh, I'm gonna get some as you can see, okay, and you have stuff like this. There is so many coffee shops here in Mid Valley, okay. You can see, but I'm gonna get probably some of these like peanut donuts and chocolate donuts. I like I like stuff like that, okay, to add to the coffee because I'm having coffee up there, okay. So I'll buy pastry from here and I'll go to the coffee shop and I sit down and eat there, okay? They're cheap here. All right, so I have some coffee. So let's go change some money, okay? For the trip tomorrow. Mid Valley Mall, as you can see, very, very nice mall. Nice, big, crowded. Because today is Sunday, so a lot of people come here on the weekends also. Well, let's go to the money changers. All right, so these are the money changers I'm talking about. Look at the queue. I have never seen a queue like this before. But I think it's because of the weekend. So you can see there is quite a few of them, at least four, like four, five, I think. So these are the ones, a lot of people here. There is another one right here. And there is this one over here, okay. All right, so as you can see, they, those, there's like five of them here. And today is like so, so crowded. Look at that. This is the shortest uh, queue I have seen. The other ones at the front there have a queue all the way to the, to the, to the main, main street over there. So it's really, really crowded. I think because, of, because it's uh, Sunday, it's like all the weekend. So everybody comes here, you know, and a lot of people are traveling. So I don't think I'm gonna change today. Because <laughs> tomorrow I still have I still have daytime tomorrow because I'm traveling at night. So I'll be free during the daytime. I can come here in the morning. I think, you know. But I'm gonna check another one. There is I know there is another one down near the parking parking lot. So I'll go there. It's the same rate. They have the same rate like these ones. And and uh, I'm just gonna go there and compare the rates first. But this is the best you can get. If you go to Bukit Bintan or any other area, or if you go to another mall, I'll try to change the money there in their money changers. Trust me, uh, the rate is, is not good. 
All right, so we just changed the money. It is so, so busy. I think because of the weekend, and uh, yeah, and uh, one thing is you cannot do two transactions because I want to change to two different currencies, Thai baht and something else to take with me as backup. But they say they only can do one transaction at a time, and then you have to go and come back again later. So one transaction per passport. So, so she asked me to just go and come back in an hour and do another one. So that's another thing that you have to know. Um, if you're changing to one currency, that's okay. You can change as much as you want. But if you're changing into like two different currencies or more, then you have to come at different times. You cannot do them all at one transaction here in Mid Valley. You know, in, in other countries, no problem. I changed in Indonesia. Like I changed the uh, Malaysian ringgit uh, into Indonesian uh, rupiah, and I changed the uh, Philippines pesos into Indonesian rupiah at the same time and didn't no problem but every country is different okay uh, so uh, so yeah so this is it this is just a, a short video today about what I'm doing and tomorrow I will be on the road to Hatiai to Thailand and I will start making this new Thailand adventure starting from tomorrow tomorrow night okay so thank you very much please subscribe and i will see you soon thank you